I'm Patrick Hughes and I'm an artist. I've been an artist for a long while and I've always been interested in humour. There's a certain moment I made a uh, first sticky out room about uh, 50 years ago and uh, since then I've made a speciality of making things in perspective sticky out that cause them to move but in reverse and I call it reverse perspective. In reverse. I think there is a sense of humour underlying everything I do and it's uh, perhaps a way of what we call pulling your leg or ideally making you think about what it is that we see, how we see and how we can be misled by what we think about what we can see. And that's the beauty of being an artist is that you leave something behind you that is much nicer than my knees, my art, you know. It's a great way of uh, defeating death, really. I love being, uh, as it were, in my tiny way, immortal. What happens roughly is I think of what to do and then uh, we get the shape made to make it. All these uh, big white shapes you see behind me. And then we design, say, Venice to go on it. And then it goes upstairs and those uh, up to 10 people paint it. We certainly do a painting a week. You know, we do about 50 or more paintings a year, oil paintings. I've sold uh, 4,000 prints, roughly, and uh, maybe 2,000 paintings and collages, some vast numbers like that. Every time you walk away from the picture, you think, oh, this thing is a, just a bit of wood, painted wood sticking out. But then when you come and you relate to it, it comes alive. Uh, that's the exciting thing, is to make something that comes alive. And, and life, you know, has always been like trying to put your finger on a bit of mercury. Once you put your finger on it, it squirts away from it. I'm in that uh, Alice in Wonderland world of uh, through the looking glass. Upside down or inside out or the wrong way round or disappearing up into itself, you know, creating from itself. I think the commonsensical view and the proper way and the normal way are all unspeakable conventions. It's exciting to, to me to have made something that is so uh, interesting and difficult to describe. Yeah, it should be, you should, when you invent something, it should be in a way difficult to describe. It, it, would, be a, it would be sad if it could be described in moments, wouldn't it? I have two reactions when I see people viewing my work. One is um, a professional kind of reaction and I see which pictures do they look at carefully, which ones do they pass by, which ones do they get very involved with, which ones are they not interested in. It's a whole reason to do it, to see the relation between people and the pictures. And it's so exciting to see people uh, taking it all in. 